we have seen how to publish the source code to Asana Keep Server. The next step is if quality gate status is failed, we want to mark this Jenkins build as failed. Otherwise, we want to succeed the build. Let me show this pipeline syntax using which how we can achieve this requirement. Yeah, we can check for wait for quality gate. If you click this help button, it's giving you some information. We are using scripted pipeline. So this is what we are interested in. So we need to wait for some time because when we publish source code to Sona Cube, right, it might take few minutes to complete that analysis and get the report. We need to wait for certain time and internally we are calling this groovy function wait for quality gate so once the quality gate status is ready that returns back your quality gate status in this case right if quality gate status is not okay we are marking this build as an error so along with this we also want to send a slack notification saying your build got failed because of quality gate issues let's get back to our source code Let's copy this. Let's create a new file. So I'm calling it as sonar status check. Paste the code. See, after this stage, we want to put the stage which checks for the status. And if status is not okay, let's mark this build as failed. Let's take the syntax from this pipeline syntax. Let's copy this. Let's paste it here. Let's call this one as quality gate status check. This particular function stops this process for one hour maximum. Within that one hour, if we get the status from Sonakube server, then this code proceeds without any block. We're getting the status from Sonakube server. From that, we are checking the status. If it is not okay, we're marking this build as an error. Along with this one, we also want to send Slack notification. Let's copy this code and let's keep it under this condition. So we are using this URL. The Slack is already configured in previous demos. This is the channel. So now in case of error, let's make it as danger. The message is displayed in red color. Message right. Let's change this message. So after sending this Slack notification, right? Using this error, we are marking this build as error. Let's save this. Let's copy this file name. So come back to Jenkins project. Click configure. So under pipeline, right? This file we have to change. Save the file and say build now. Okay, we forgot to configure Sonacube web hooks. Let's do that. Otherwise, this is going to be blocked forever. Let's go back to Sonar Cube server. Click administration. So under administration, select webhooks. Give some meaningful name here. I'm calling it as Jenkins server and the URL of Jenkins server. This is the URL of Jenkins machine, the IP address, port number, slash, sonarcube-webhook. 
this trialing slash is mandatory. After configuring this webhook, when Jenkins checks for the status, whenever the status is available, this sends a notification back to Jenkins, which is used by our Jenkins pipeline script there. So save this. Come back to our Jenkins job. See, this is still waiting because it's blocked. It's blocked because we didn't configure webhooks before. So cancel this. Come back and say build again. See now it says in progress. Again it was checking back and it says success. And we, we are saying that the Sonar Cube quality status checks succeeded. And finally your build also got succeeded. For success we are also sending a Slack notification. In case this is not okay right. It also sends a notification saying the job failed because of quality gate status failed. This is how we mark Jenkins build as failed if something goes wrong in sonar cube quality checks.